For two decades, Musafa's life was bound by cruel iron chains that tethered him to a weathered truck. He never felt the soft embrace of grass beneath his paws, nor the thrill of chasing prey through the dense underbrush. His world was reduced to a small space, a prison where he endured perpetual beatings and suffered in silence. News of Musafa's plight reached the ears of a compassionate organization known as Animal Rights International. The staff members knew they had to act swiftly to save this magnificent creature from the clutches of despair. Months were spent strategizing, planning, and gathering evidence to bring justice to Musafa's tragic circumstances. Finally, the fateful day arrived when the organization's unwavering dedication bore fruit. Supported by the weight of public opinion, they succeeded in convincing the authorities to close down the circus. The law stood strong, declaring that no creature should suffer in such deplorable conditions. As the circus dismantled, Musafa's chains were unlocked, releasing him from the suffocating grip that had tormented him for far too long. Yet freedom for him did not mean returning to the wild he had never known. His decades of captivity had eroded his ability to hunt, his instincts dulled by the artificial world he had been subjected to. But Animal Rights International refused to let Musafa's story end without a glimmer of hope. A sprawling enclosure designed to replicate his natural habitat was painstakingly constructed. It was a space where the weary cougar could finally stretch his limbs, feel the warmth of sunlight on his fur, and experience a taste of the life that had been stolen from him. As Musafa stepped into his new domain, a mix of apprehension and curiosity flickered in his eyes. Days turned into weeks, and weeks into months, as Musafa cautiously explored the boundaries of his newfound freedom. Slowly but surely, he discovered the joys of splashing in a sparkling pond, basking in the glow of a setting sun, and watching the stars twinkle overhead. Although he had missed out on the prime years of his life, Musafa was given a taste of the happiness and serenity that had eluded him for so long.